Okay, in this video I'm going to show how to find divergence, uh, positive or negative. So let's do a search first for good seasonal stocks. And I have good uh, seasonal win percentage of 75, positive. Uh, seasonality area, 30 days. Let's put positive. Uh, let's lower this, let's say this to, say, 12%. Uh, price above six dollars, good open interest, a hundred to a thousand, volume over three hundred thousand, and then let's put the correlation there, and we'll screen. Okay, let's uh, search right here, and this was positive here, so we found um, right here forty-nine good stocks, and let's control C, let's select them all. Sorry, I was missing a couple there. Let me just select it again. And go Control C. And let's open up an Excel file. Okay, and we'll just paste it in Excel here. And what we'll do is we select all these symbols. Okay, and now we're going to open up. We're going to copy these symbols and we're going to open up a ramp. And we're going to create a new list. So I'm going to go new and let's put seasonal calls and I'll replace it. Yep. And let's paste uh, this and let's save it right here. And I'm going to use this list and you can see how it's using the seasonal calls list. And now we'll do a, a MACD divergence scan. And here you can change if you use a different MACD. Uh, but let's let's do for a bullish scan. See if we find any bullish uh, divergent stocks. And the good thing here, one they're going to have divergence, and two they're going to have good uh, seasonality here. So let's see how many they find, and you can see how it found uh, seven of these. You can see from right here, seven of them. That have good seasonality coming up, and they have good divergence on, on it. And you could just uh, analyze, see which one has better divergence than uh, the others, and compare the seasonality here. Okay, we can also do this uh, with puts, and with the puts, I would just change this to negative, change this to negative. And let's search, and it found 41 right here. And let's control Z, control C, sorry. And let's create a new uh, Excel file here. And we'll go right here and we'll paste this. Now we'll select um, all of these right here. And I'm going to copy them. Okay, let's go over to ramp and we'll create a new list and let's new right here and let's call it seasonal puts okay and i'll click ok and we'll replace the list let's save right here and let's say use this list and now we can just change uh we can look for divergence and bearish divergence so stocks that have a divergent bearish divergence and that have strong seasonality to the downside so we can see right here it found several stocks right here so you can see it found save SBG UAL FLT uh, you just compare to see if, does it have good divergence and um, Obviously, we know that it has good seasonality. Uh, if you want to broaden it up, uh, you can and get a bigger list. You might want to go down here to 10 and go right here to 70. We might be able to take off this indicator right here and grow the list a little bit more to 65 uh, stocks that tend to go down during, during this time frame. Okay, so this is how you look for divergence plays using seasonality and this is the way you scan from 
using magenta and rep.